I am 100% and so is my husband, 100% uh, um, happy and satisfied with, with, um, with our stay here and with the treatment and yeah, the staff, everything, been, been wonderful, really wonderful. What's your name, where are you from and what brought you to the clinic? Uh, my name is Jennifer, uh, we came from Malta and uh, we actually heard about the uh, stem cell therapy uh, through a friend of ours. So that's what brought us here um, to the clinic here in Serbia. And what the diagnosis or condition of your child? It was um, for ASD, autism level 2. Mm -hmm. And when so, he was diagnosed? He was diagnosed uh, officially a couple of months ago. Um, I would say maybe about five, six months ago. And uh, what are the symptoms? Well, it was something I noticed a bit earlier before the diagnosis and um, before we started looking into it professionally. He would flap his hands a lot, uh, run up and down the walls. Um, wasn't speaking coherently, um, sort of staring off in the beginning, didn't use to make eye contact. Um, yeah, just just basically some abnormalities with his behavior. So. And how did you come up with the idea of trying stem cells? Well, um, obviously, you know, like I said, just through people that, um, that we know that have children as well, uh, some of those have children with autism and had explored the, the stem cell treatment and then obviously we looked into it, did a bit of our own research and uh, decided to, to give it a bash, to give it a try. Did you have some kind of fears or concerns about the stem cell treatment? Well, I think everybody does initially um, because it's, it's fairly new um, and, and not terribly terribly well well known you know um, so yeah there is that element of, of fear you know um, is it foolproof is it safe enough um, but you know uh, obviously the research that's been done and and the treatment and the track record is, is um, yeah. and how did you deal with those questions like probably you had a consultation with our doctors or something else well, well, yeah, um, just just basically, you know, that um, that there, there is no high risk um, element in, in doing something like that, this and, and um, you know, like I said, they've got a very good track record um, out of nothing major ever happening, you know, that one should be concerned about. So, yeah, it's, it's very safe. Can you please guide me about the process of the treatment? How was it for your child? It was good. Obviously, our son is uh, only three years old. So being that young and having to deal with, um, you know, a legal intravenous um, uh, application of, of, of the treatment, you know, it was a little bit, um, a little bit of a, ch a challenge, but not that much. Um, you know, as, as he was given very sort of light sedation, mm -hmm. uh, you know, to calm him, he relaxed completely. Mm -hmm. So it was actually very, very, very smooth sailing. Very, you yeah. know. What type of stem cells uh, did you get? Um, we had stem cells from the uh, placenta, mm -hmm. stem cells from uh, the umbilical cord. Mm -hmm. um, yes, and then there were different methods in administering that as well. And have you got uh, inhalation of exosomes? Yes, that is correct. Yes, we had that. Uh -huh. We had um, two doses. Many people don't know about the existence of Serbia. And yeah, and they very afraid to come to Serbia, especially if they Google something, they find some different information about Serbia. How did you feel in Serbia? 100% safe and, and um, at home and, and comfortable. Uh, no, no worries or no concerns whatsoever. Um, yeah, very, very, very good. Very safe, very professional, very... It's clean, it's lovely here. 
it's um, you know in terms of where the clinic is surrounded and you know uh, obviously Serbia is a very large country <laughs> but yes completely um, sort of first world if, if you would like as far as I'm concerned you know. And did you find it difficult to talk to doctors, nurses, I don't know, kitchen staff to to staff in the clinic? Uh... Absolutely not, no, absolutely not. Everybody has been very, very friendly, very professional. Um, when it came to sort of, you know, the technical medical um, sort of discussions that we had with the doctors, it was put in layman's terms, so to speak, that, you know, that, that I could understand exactly uh, what was happening and, um, you know, how, how things uh, would be administered and the processes and so on and so forth. And staff extremely friendly, um, understood every request. Um, yes, no, communication, not a problem whatsoever. Why have you chosen Swiss Medica? What, what have you seen or heard about Swiss Medica that you decided to, to come to Swiss Medica? Well, like I said, we, we, we actually sort of found out um, about Swiss Medica in particular uh, through some friends, uh, more, more on my husband's side. My husband's from Macedonia and obviously Macedonia, Serbia being in the Balkan, he's got a lot of Balkan friends. And so that's how we found out, out about Swiss Medica having a clinic in Serbia. And so it obviously just makes sense for us to travel from Malta to Macedonia and then from Macedonia drive through to Serbia and at the same time spend time with, with family in Macedonia, you know, mm -hmm. as well as quite easily come here to Serbia for, for the treatments. Yeah. Before coming to the treatment, uh, I assume you had an online consultation with our doctors? That is correct, yes, we did. Okay. Uh, did you have some kind of expectation uh, of the treatment? Uh, did they say? Did the doctors tell you something what to expect and, um, when, and when to expect? Yes, yes, they did. Um, in the sense that you know there there are certain expectations and goals um, that would you know be ideally um, reached but also it was made clear to us that it's not some sort of miracle treatment that's uh, that's just going to work every time for everyone and fix every last little problem you know so we were um, under no uh, illusion you know um, about uh, about all of it it was it was very clear that that yes, it's got a, a very high factor of, of, of working, but yes, it's not a, a miracle. Mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. Did you discuss the idea of trying stem cell treatment with your, with your doctor, pediatrician? Or... Uh, you mean just, just our, our general GP doctor? Yeah. Back home? No, no, not at all. Would you like to say something additional? Probably I didn't ask something, but you would like to share uh, with me some about something. Um, no, well, it's it's a it's a little bit um, difficult just to to comment further because obviously now it's it's more of a waiting game just to see how you know the treatment's going to play out over the next um, couple of months and um, to to monitor improvements and so on and so forth, but. Um, I am 100% and so is my husband, 100% uh, um, happy and satisfied with, with, um, with our stay here and with the treatment and yeah, the staff, everything, been, been wonderful, really wonderful.